All right, so it seems like there's a huge controversy in the world right now, and uh, since I'm a huge nerd, I wanted to really prove my point that this dress is blue and black. And you may be shocked. If you haven't heard any of this before, you probably just haven't been on Twitter or Facebook or talked to anybody or anything, because this is just such a big deal right now for whatever reason. Basically, the backstory of this quickly is that this dress is blue and black. Some people see it as white and gold. The reason for that is because similar to hearing, apparently, right, this is what I've read, is that, because uh, I Googled it, I was really confused why people we're seeing this and it's a huge debate all day today but uh, basically just like hearing some people can see or hear really high pitched some people can't hear really high pitched same idea with color none of us can see ultraviolet but all of us can see visible color visible light so at some point there's a cutoff for everyone it's not a fine line like none of us can see visible light and this is where it cuts off none of us can hear high pitched sound and this is where it cuts off it's variable so everyone can kind of see similarly but there's a cutoff for where we actually can see that light. And uh, I'll show you guys that. So I'll actually show you this dress is blue and black, and I'll try to make it really quick. So if you go ahead and just grab the eyedropper tool, tool in Photoshop to be able to see a color, and you click on this part that's blue, some people are saying it's white, you'll see that the color is definitely blue. You can see the blue palette comes up right away. It's a blue, blue color, and wherever you click on the dress, it's gonna shift around a little bit. But wherever you click, it's always blue. It's never gonna go up here to white. This would be white, right? You can see the contrast of white and the color of the dress. Um, so wherever you click in here, it's always blue, it's never white up here, and you can see the contrast of color. And if you go to like the darkest part, you can see, look how dark that is versus, um, it's like, yeah, the darkest color. You can see like current, new. You can see that they're different shades of blue, but it's all blue. The other part that people are kind of confused about is the lines of the dress. Is it black or is it gold? Um, and like I said, you can only see this really as blue and black or white and gold. So as far as the lines go, it's like a brown color. So I say it's black. It looks black, just like a poorly lit black photo, but it's kind of like brownish, uh, but by no means is it gold. Because remember, gold is this color up here. This is gold. This is the color of the dress. It's like, it's brown. It's brownish black. It's, it's more black than anything else, uh, I think. Uh, but you can see here, no matter where you click, it's like in the brown, black range. It's never up here in like orangey gold. I mean, orange is the closest it gets, right? Like this is red, right? The red, wet, red would be that, that color when it's, uh, you know, in that palette. But it never goes to like a gold palette like this. This would be gold up here. Um, and you can see that that color never shows up. It's always brown. So definitely like a brown black, but I'd say black and blue to make it really simple. Now for anybody wanting to see the black and blue in this dress that's still really confused, here you go. So if you change the brightness down, even on your phone, if you go into any app and you change the brightness uh, down lower or darken the image, I'm not gonna change any of the colors. The colors are all the same this entire time. Um, you can see this might at some point become black and blue for you at some point in this, in this picture. It's gonna become black and blue. Um, and if it hasn't yet, I'll change the contrast too, so you can see it even more. Um, it might become really, really uh, blue for you at some point here. So this is like the extreme version, but it's the same colors. Um, they haven't changed uh, at, at all, really. They're just going to be darker, but they're still the same core colors. And when I click, you can see they're still blue. They're just going to be a darker version of that, so you can actually see. So the dress, once again, same color as it was. Um, to, to show the opposite, some people won't be able to see the blue dress if you do this. If you actually make it really bright, the blue might go away. For me, all still blue. All still blue, all still blue. Um, but I, I don't know. I guess for some people's eyes, once again, it's like that range of color. So if you make it really contrasted, it might at some point become a gold and white dress. But the core dress is blue and black this dress is a blue and black dress as you can see these color matchings are blue and black so that's it that's the dress controversy tried to sum it up really quick because i'm a huge nerd there you go dress controversy done